What is going on, people? I am here for day number eight of the 31 Days Hath October series, which I'm doing on this channel, but I just got done doing a review of this. The Friday the 13th box set. So go ahead, check that out right after you're done watching this video, and maybe you might want to pick that up. Anyway, uh, for those of you who don't know what this 31 Days Hath October series is, it's where I do 31 horror movie reviews in 31 days. Uh, I do it a little bit different. I call it a little bit different. I try to do more independent titles, and I try to do them in alphabetical order. Uh, hold, there's a whole bunch of people doing some kind of 31 days, whether it be the 13th Wolfman, Jonathan Moody, uh, Moods. Uh, there's a whole bunch of people, so just check out the uh, show. Uh, I always say show notes, but it's not show notes. Anyway... Check out the description so you can see everybody else doing some kind of 31 days. Uh, like I said, I do it different. I call it 31 days, half October. It's uh, I do it in the uh, independent movies, and I try to do it uh, alphabetical order. Uh, and today's letter is G. Um, but uh, before I get into it, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And of course, hit that bell button. Don't really need to do it this month because I'm doing a review every day. Um, but hit that bell button in case you want to check out more videos after this month. Um, like I said, it is the letter G. Uh, one of the days I did um, I did do a horror movie unboxing, so I counted that as a day. Um, but anyway, the movie I'm reviewing is Girl on the Third Floor. Uh, this movie is put out by Dark Sky Films. Uh, it's... Written uh, or directed by Travis Stevens. It's written by Greg Newman, Trent Haga, and others. Uh, it stars Phil Brooks, a.k.a. CM Punk. Uh, you might know him from wrestling. Uh, what is this? Triste Kelly Dunn. Probably horribly butchered that name. Uh, Sarah Brooks, among many others. And no, it's not, um, it's not CM Punk's wife. It's... Just someone else who has uh, Brooks as the last name. Anyway, girl on the third floor. Uh, CM Punk's character is pretty much trying to fix up this new place, this new house uh, that he has with his family, or trying to, uh, you know, fix up the house for him and his family, his wife and his kid. Uh, so he goes to this house pretty much alone all the time, trying to renovate it, trying to fix it, trying to do all that stuff. He got it on, you know, for pretty cheap. Uh, and, you know, sometimes you question why uh, certain houses go for so much cheaper than others. Well, let's just say this might not be a just an ordinary house. Uh, because as he's trying to fix this stuff up, uh, let's just say things start happening. He starts seeing things. He gets visited by certain things. I don't, I'm not going to get into it. But let's just say this house, which seems kind of normal, might not be that normal or might not be as normal as uh you know one might think from just looking at it uh this is more of a thriller i guess you would call it it has its horror aspects there is some gore in this but it's more i think of a, a thriller slash maybe ghost story i guess you want to call it uh but it is like i said uh does star cm punk so this is pretty much one of the first movies i saw him acting in uh you know not too bad for a first go uh, is it the greatest no i wouldn't say that but uh as going through it you know it is um kind of uh you know, bumpy at points, but overall, I think he did a pretty good job for his first, you know, full length feature. Uh, I guess you want to call it this is after his UFC stint and stuff, after a few fights. Um, but uh, like I said, it is kind of like a ghost story kind of deal, kind of one of those thriller type deals. Uh, so, you know, if you're interested, uh, definitely go ahead, check this one out. Uh, what I do for every review is I'll leave the trailer, I'll leave the link to where you can purchase it, and then, like I said, check the uh, description so you can see everyone else doing some kind of uh, 31 days. Um, so uh, I tend to keep these uh, videos a little bit shorter just because, like I said, 31 horror movie reviews in 31 days is kind of draining. Plus, like I said, I did the uh, Friday the 13th uh, set. But, like I said, if you're into uh, ghost stories, if you're into a little gore here and there, uh, 
definitely check out this one here, Girl on the Third Floor. Like I said, put out by Dark Sky Films. So I'll leave everything that I'm talking about in uh, the description so you can check that out, as well as all my other social medias. And of course, like I said, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, hit that uh, thumbs up if you enjoyed this little short review, and of course, hit that bell button. Let me know in the comments if you've seen this or what you thought of it or anything like that. Uh, but the main thing is, too, if you don't want to see this one or you've seen it already check out everybody doing some kind of 31 days because you know everybody loves watching horror movies in uh october and you know besides my channel check out everybody else's so you might see something new so i guess until tomorrow i'll see you guys